Is that is that wrong? You think somebody to say that at a funeral? Nah, that's the truth. Like the we truth ought to have you, you can't be mad at the truth. That's real. You can't be mad at the truth. Because if but I'm be, out here, think about it. If if I meet you, I, I met you, I met y'all, and y'all was like, man, you was a good dude. But everybody else that you know that met me, I robbed them. Mm-hmm. <laughs> that would be bad, but. You'll be like, hey, he was cool to us. Like, we liked mm-hmm. him. You know what I'm saying? We spent a lot of time around him. He didn't never he do that like that. That was dope. Right. Yeah, we on Boss Talk TV. Shout out to E. He the reason you see me. Man, you know, um, you 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 gotta understand, man. When I look on the internet, I'm always seeing something, man. It was a uh, a deal where uh, I think it was a uh, big gift. Big gift shot at your daddy out. Yeah. And um, he said that he was a real one. You know what I'm saying? Like um, a real stepper. Like he, if he said he'll do it type situation. Um, how many of those stories do you hear like that? Everybody got that story. Everybody. But you know, a lot of people don't got so. Th- th- that's show you the difference in people who really, you know, people who met him and people who really knew him. Yeah, yeah, people who met him and people who really knew him. It, it's crazy, but at the end of the day, I think because Big Gip, you know, he been on, he been doing his uh, interview runs here lately, he was able to, you know, he tapped into that situation where, like, hey, man, I got to shout him out. Because if you get an opportunity and you knew him, from what I'm seeing, everybody loved your pops when it come down to, the way he carried himself in the hood. He, even the even the niggas who didn't like him, who did have a problem with him at the time, they they still act like they, you know what I'm saying? So a lot of that, you you asked that one time. And that's the thing, and I was just about, I was just thinking about that question, is the fact that, okay, because I've met, okay, every time we go to New Orleans, or anytime we talk to anybody about oh, Soldier Slim, everybody's like, oh man, we love him, we love him, we love him. But I met one person who from down there, they live up here now, and there was like, all that's fake. The only dude that now that he's gone, he's but gone. whenever he was there, they didn't show him that type of love when he was alive. Yeah, that's it, just like, I was watching this, this interview on uh, UTP Skip did. He was like, I seen that niggas, one. He was like, niggas was messing with Slim, but they wasn't messing with him like that. They wasn't even booking for $2,000, you know mm. what I'm saying? Like, real talk. Yeah, and, and so, yeah, because I hadn't heard Skip even speak in a minute. Like, to see that interview, I was happy to see that. Like, so so you did watch that one. Mm-hmm. And, and and the one thing I, I can say, I don't care who you interview, where you interview them, if you interview anybody in New Orleans, it, your dad's name is coming up, bro. For sure. And others, and not just New Orleans, but in the South, man. I, but, I, but how does that make you feel when, you know, to hear that when he was here, they didn't give him that love, but now that he's gone, they're trying to give him love. How? I mean, I know, to me, that's I, sort of like fake. That's fake love. I know what it was. It's cut through for a reason. Mm. I know what it was. I mean. Wow. I, 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 I get it because, like I said, when you deal with uh, certain people, it, it, it's good and bad every time mm. you look around. Like, you're going to meet a lot of people that see me, like, man, that nigga used to be in them streets and and, 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 whoop, 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 and he was cool, but then this other one's going to say he wasn't cool. But one, but one thing about it, at the funeral, everybody say something nice. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Everybody trying to be cool, and he was a good man, you know, and I think that kind of thing happens a lot when it comes down to individuals. You know, only one funeral I know when the dude got up, he was like, this dude wasn't really no good. Like, like He must have never... was really a messed up person. <laughs> like, thought that he wasn't no good. Uh, right, that person he, was totally honest. Yeah, he ended up getting killed because he, it was, really he was just putting himself in the wrong situation. Like, is that is that wrong? You think somebody to say that at a funeral? Nah, that's the truth. Like the we truth ought to have you, you can't be mad at the truth. That's real. You can't be mad at the truth because if but I'm be, out here, think about it. If if I meet you, I, I met you, I met y'all, and y'all was like, man, you was a good dude. But everybody else that you know that met me, I robbed them. Mm-hmm. That would be bad, but you'll be like, hey, he was cool to us. Like we liked mm-hmm. him. You know what I'm saying? We spent a lot of time around him. He didn't never he do that like there, that. Right? That was dope. Right. But we just had favor with him. Mm-hmm. And I, I think I, I bet it, it is people out there like that too. Mm-hmm. That just don't rock with it's everybody. There's people like that about me, so I I know. It it can go down. Yeah, we on Boss Talk TV. Shout out to E. He the reason you see.